All right, thanks for joining us, Caleb. Michael, Co, go ahead. Caleb, congratulations on the win. What do you think your team showed out there today? Uh, I just feel like we showed a lot of toughness, uh, a lot of grit. And, uh, you know, coming in here uh, just with this atmosphere, um, it's, it's tough to win in. So um, I feel like we just played smart, we played hard, and uh, we, we played with a lot of effort. Thank you. CL? Hey, for, for you personally in the same, it, it seemed like uh, from up here, it seemed like you tried specifically to get everyone else involved before you ever really started looking for your shot. Was, did, did I see that right? And, and if so, wh why did you go about it that way? Yeah, for sure. You know, uh, Virginia Tech is a solid defensive team in the half quarter. So um, you're not really going to score um, like on the first first pass or, or second pass, you got to break the defense down. So uh, I got downhill and I, I broke the defense down and, and find an open man and, and uh, it was successful. And then uh, it opened up shots for myself. Adam Smith. Caleb, along those very same lines, you know, I, I felt like there was a stretch in the, the first half where you sort of hit the takeover gear. Uh, you know, you're scoring and, uh, you know, the cross court passes in the half court to RJ, like, like, um, is that one of the more freeing stretches you think you've had personally, just, you know, in a game recently, uh, sort of that extra gear that you found there in the first half? Yeah, for sure. You know, uh, coming into the game, um, we, we, we had played the game we played before and, and it, it wasn't good. So, um, I've just been watching a lot of film on the bad shots I was taking and, and the turnovers that I had and seeing what I can get better and and what i can what i can do to to get this team over the hump because uh we don't want to continue going down this stretch in, in february and then into march we don't want to it's, it's about to be win or go home so uh, just cleaning up those solid cleaning up those things and being solid and so that's what i did i like i said i got downhill um broke the defense down find an open man or created for myself what were you uh what were you telling the students there at the end when you dribbled the clock out you're motioning Tell them yeah, something. I was just like, let me hear you, let me hear you, because uh, I, you know, they was they was talking all game, and, and uh, you know, you live for those moments, and you and you love those type of type of games. Thank you, a Andrew Jones. Caleb, you guys had a twenty-two six run in the first half. It was kind of triggered by Leaky. He had made a couple of defensive plays, had a couple of drives, got to the rim, got fouled, scored the first five points of that run. Did you kind of sense? Maybe you guys sort of shift maybe your disposition a little bit once Leaky made those plays. And because at that point, after the rest of the run, you hit some buckets, well, RJ hit some buckets. It seemed like it was spread around pretty well. Yeah, for sure. You know, Leaky has been like that all season for us, and he's, he's been playing great all season. And so uh, we feed off his energy, we feed off his play. Um, sometimes he's not a, 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 as, as vocal, but you know, his play is going to gonna make up for that. So. Um, so we feed off him and we go as we go. As well. So, uh, you know, he, he's one of the leaders on this team and, and, and I'm, I'm grateful to have him as a teammate. Staying on that, did you sense that Virginia Tech kind of tightened during that run? They never really, they were looser beforehand, never really got that loose the rest of the game? Yeah, for sure. You know, uh, we, we, we put our foot on their necks and, and, and they couldn't figure it out at the time. And, and so we, in, in the huddle, we was telling them, come on, keep going, keep going, one play by play. And so uh, that's what we did. Thank you. Greg Barnes. Go ahead, bud. Hey, Caleb. Uh, this place was, was pretty electric there to start the game and then at various times throughout. This team has struggled in that type of setting this season. What was different tonight? Uh, I just think uh, we were poised. That was, the, that was the game plan going into the game, uh, to be poised in these type of situations just in this atmosphere because the game can shift. Um, it kind of shifted in the second half. Uh, we, we was – we weren't making as many buckets and they were scoring and the crowd was getting into us. So we just had to come back together and uh, play play one one play at a time. And so um, that, that was what we did all, all game. We were real poised. We never got rattled. Um, and so uh, we came out with a win. Thank you. All right, Gregory Hall, last one for uh, Caleb. Go ahead. Caleb, this was one of a few instances this season where you guys have bounced back um, in proper fashion. What's the secret, do you think, to – preventing having to bounce back and just keep something like today moving forward? Just not getting complacent. Uh, you know, uh, one win is not going to, you know, satisfy our season uh, and not getting satisfied at all. Uh, with one win, we got to uh, play one game at a time uh, one, and go 1-0. Every every game we go, we go out, we're going trying to go 1-0. Um, yeah, we got this good this, – this was a great win for us, but 
you know, we got Louisville next, and, and now we focus on them. Thanks, Caleb. Appreciate your time.